Hello, my name is Scott Danberg here with Challenge Athletes Foundation. I'm with my good friend and Paralympic athlete. I'm Justin Fongspawn. I'm an F54 seated thrower. The throwing techniques that we're going to review work well both for a straddle position or a front facing position. Justin and I are going to demonstrate for you how to throw the shot put from a seated straddled position. First and foremost, we want to review the technique or the finer points of throwing the shot put appropriately. First and foremost, how is Justin going to address and hold the holding bar as well as the placement of his shot put and throwing arm? So as we reviewed in previous videos, please if you haven't seen them, go back and review those. Justin's blocking arm would be at the same plane or angle as the release of the shot. Justin is grabbing the holding bar and holding into that position. From there, he puts the shot put, which we will demonstrate for you, and holds it next to his neck. It's really important there as we're seeing that there is a 90 degree angle between his throwing arm and his torso. Now there's three different positions or techniques that Justin could throw from. One would be just a rotational. Justin would rotate back, come through, proud chest, release forward. The second would be, load up again Justin, would be what we call a linear position. He would just come back without any twist and explode forward and release. The third, which works well for Justin, is combining those two movements. Justin will rock back and rotate and explode forward and release. Now, regardless of what technique you use, and I invite and have you explore all of these with your athletes, is that Justin is leading the movement with his chest. Justin, show the movement again for us. Go in slow motion. He comes back, he twists. The first movement is the chest. Chin is high, chest is towards the sector, and now he is releasing. Notice how his thumb is down, his pinky is high. When he gets to the end of his extension, he flips that wrist, almost as if you're flipping a lampshade. From here, you have a follow through, and he comes down in order not to stall that movement whatsoever. We'll put that together now with the shot put. What's important with the shot put, and I'll follow along with Justin in this movement, that's very important that it rests, if you will, between the base of the fingers and the palm of the hand. The thumb and the pinky now serve as stability. We, as most athletes, and Justin now bring the shot put above us to prepare ourselves to throw, almost to feel like we had that spring movement. We bring that, nestle that to the neck. Thumb is down, pinky is up, all important, our 90 degree angle. Justin will go into position, a linear tilt with rotation. What leads first? His chest. Chin is high, obviously he will hold onto the shot put and not throw it into your home living rooms and release. Let's throw a few. Sounds good. <laughs> 